Ever played golf at the LOI golf course? The chances are you haven't. There's only a few people who play there, and you're much more likely to get a tee time if you know someone in city government. As a city-run golf course, it's political, of course, and it's been that way for a long time. Although it's not a particularly good golf course, it sits nestled on a huge amount of acreage on the Alawai Canal, bounded by Kapahulu and Date Street, fenced off on a ton of prime and well-located real estate in the center of our city. Is this its highest and best use? We talk a lot about the iconic properties in our city, such as the natatorium, but those conversations go on forever without result, demonstrating the remarkable inability of our officials to make decisions or get anything done. Worse yet is the lack of any conversation about the Alawai golf course. It's also an iconic property, but serves only a few when it could be serving all of us. It's a perfect place for a wonderful city park, but instead, it's a huge political embarrassment. Fact is, we don't have enough parks in our city, where the high-rise condos increasingly crowd out the mountains, the ocean, the sky, and the people. You'd think our city officials would have noticed this. Kapiolani Park is not enough, and Kaka'ako Waterfront Park is only for the homeless. We need more parks, and better and bigger parks, and public spaces to keep up with the overwhelming crush of our city. Yes, Alawai Golf Course could become Alawai Park, the central park of Honolulu, a place of recreation and rest for all of our people, including visitors, a place to get away from the bustle and the madding crowd. There was an inspirational letter to the editor of the Star Advertiser on this point. The city owns Alawai. The city could so easily develop a park there. There are already open fields and green grass and even a clubhouse. There's room for picnics and barbecues, walking and bike paths, ball fields and parking, making this into a park that wouldn't cost very much, a park that would serve everyone, a park that would be very, very popular. So if our city officials wanted to do something, anything, to benefit the people and the quality of our lives together in this city, they would and should make Alawai into a big, beautiful, sprawling park. They should have done this years ago, and there is no reason at all why they can't do it now. What a great idea. What a great project for 2018. Is anyone listening?